And what about so, John Nicholson? Well, of course, David Cameron doesn't really want to leave Europe at all, but he's being buffeted by his own party. I sit in the House of Commons and I watch some of the Europhobes, the kind of swivel-eyed obsessives, <laughs> to, to mix my Radio 4 programmes. If this was Desert Island Discs, I'd be swimming towards the sharks. <laughs> To get away from, uh, from some of them, no names, no pack drill. His, his demands are very modest. Uh, Nigel Lawson has called them disappointingly unambitious. But I expect very soon we'll witness David Cameron returning from Europe, waving yes. a triumphant ne yes. negotiating um, document. And he will, will he be, be lauded. Will be airport? <laughs> well, exactly. I didn't want to draw two exact parallels. But indeed, the, the steps of the aircraft uh, announcing his triumphant success. Look... My position and my party's position is very clear. We're in favour of Europe for all sorts of reasons, not least the jobs that it brings. And the opinion polls show just how dangerous the results of Mr Cameron's brinkmanship are because the last YouGov poll I saw had 57% of Scots wanting to stay in the European Union, only 28% wanting to leave. But by contrast, 43% of English people want to leave and only 40% want to remain. So it could well be that we have a referendum in which Scotland votes to stay and England votes to pull out, and wouldn't that be a dramatic result? Well, the implication, well, of, that, the implication yeah. of that is that for you, given that you are passionate for independence, it would be rather good if oh. the vote turned out to be no, because you might have a better chance, A, of getting um, your, your, your referendum on, on uh, separation, and B, you could then hope, conceivably, that you get to stay or get into Europe. Well, we don't call it separation. We call it independence. Separation uh, is, is, is altogether too negative a word. But I am in favour of Europe, and I want to see Scotland, I want to see the United Kingdom remaining in the European Union, and I will be campaigning for that, as will my party.